right, guys. Here to put out another video for you guys today. I wanted to hook you guys up. I know some people are thinking, how do you play your Plex if the internet goes down? My movies aren't playing on my stuff. And you're like, I've looked everywhere. They say it doesn't work. It does work. There's a trick I found out that you guys can do, and I want to share it with you guys. Because let's be honest, why do we have Plex, our own Plex? So we can watch our own movies, and we can watch them without having streaming services. And I tell you what, I don't want have to have only internet to watch my movies. I want to be able to watch them anytime I want, 24-7 of the day. As long as I have power in my house, I, thou shall watch my movies. So, first thing you got to do is go to your settings tab. Then after you're in your settings tab, go to network. Network. Scroll all the way down to the bottom and it says list of IP address and networks that are allowed without authentication authentication so basically i think when the plex goes up there it needs authentication to the server uh to say hey this person is allowed access to this you know to play it obviously it wouldn't work out of sight because if your nas is offline it ain't gonna know anywhere to go so it just needs to be that handshake saying yes you can watch the movies and stuff like that so basically this is saying if the server's down the device's listed IP address here will be able to watch the movies without the handshake. You basically say, I don't need the handshake. You know me and stuff, so let's get it going right here. So all you have to do is, is comma, separating the list of IP addresses, slashes for network mask uh, of the network that allowed to access Plex Media Server without logging in. When the server is signed out, the value is set. Oh, yeah, only local hosts and addresses on this list will be allowed so <clears throat> i'll tell you what i did try it with the main uh you know my router's address don't do that just do the device address if you got your network done correctly and you have your stuff labeled of course your server should i mean your stuff that you stream with should have a static ip address just set it to that i put mine my nvidia shield is at 192.168.1.154 submit mask slash submit mask 255.255.255.0 and boom no problem plays and i was and i have two servers so i set both of them to that one and if it doesn't take effect after you do it and you hit save and you're like oh play so unplug my internet oh it's still not working restart your server Obviously, you want to make sure that you're sure you have you do this before you don't have internet because you won't be able to log into your Plex, you know, interface without internet. But um, yeah, just make sure that you do this before you have internet, and you should have no problems. Remember, if it doesn't work the first time after you've saved this, restart your server, and it should work flawlessly. You should have no problems right there. You can add multiple IP addresses in there too to make sure if you have a couple streaming devices in your house. But it'll work, and it worked crazy good. The only thing you got to think of is, I'm going to show you a demonstration here. Is the but you got to be able to wait a little bit when you log into Plex. Because just try for that handshake. Might take a little time. Sometimes the uh, page, your art won't load right away, but your movie will be able to play, and that's the most important thing. I don't care if I can't see the cover. I know what the movie is by the name. I can look it up on my phone if I really wanted that bad. And be, oh yeah, that's the one. And play it. That's the most important. Some of them will load. It just depends on if you know. Plex is hosting it or you're hosting it local. That's the only thing it depends on. Or if you have them on your drive too, it should work too that way. Sometimes it doesn't, sometimes it does, but either way you can still play your movies and it works great. I have had no problems with it. On my Nvidia Shield, I tried it for a whole week. No problems. Not down for a whole week as in unplugging it and I even restarted my router at within network is still unplugged and you know just to clear all the catch and all that stuff still works fine. No problems. Everything loaded. But all right guys, Let's get back into what it looks like on the TV. All right, guys, to show you guys, I'm at my friend's house. I just did it to his NAS just to show you there's no internet. Go to YouTube. Try again. Open network settings. Doesn't work. Can't connect. If you go to his network, and we go to network. Oops. Network connected, but there is nothing. Look, connected. See, no internet connection. So now, home, go down. See, look right here. Ethernet not connected because I think there's no internet. So now we're going to go to his NAS. Flex, might take a minute. 
for the first time since there's no internet. So you have to wait here for a minute. This is where it's trying to look for the handshake. Might take a minute, just hold your horses. Because once it's up, it's up. I closed out of the app completely. There we go. So now, Ninja Turtles is right there. Continue watching. We can just go play from start. And there we go. All right, guys. Back to the main part of the video. All right, guys. So I do these videos for you guys. I want you guys to have a rock and rolling day. Please like, comment, hit the subscribe button. For tech info, cool stuff all the time. Try to help you guys out just to make your life better. Rock and roll. Please hit the subscribe button. Helps me out immensely so I can make better videos for you guys. Peace out. Keep on trucking.